Hello and welcome to Sparkles and Tilly Cook Some Yorkies. Now uh, I've got no idea how this is going to go and I'm probably going to have to stop and start a few times to make sure I've got the recipe right. But uh, we'll have a bash and if it doesn't work I'll just delete the video. Here comes Matilda and we're going to try and as you see we're going to have to keep repositioning. Hello! And we're going to try and cook some Yorkies together. Here is my wonderful assistant chef. Are you excited to cook the Yorkies? Yorkies! So the first thing we need to do is pour some oil in the Yorkie tray. So here we go. And this is not one that I'm excited about doing. Not when it's this big. Right, I will show you one, and then you've got to do the rest. Okay. And it will splash. There you go. Can she do it? Pressure is on. Oh, that's a good effort. Keep going. You've got 12 to do. Capable assistant Nancy Powers. You just want to do it everything, doesn't he? How on earth are they going to do this? Do you want me to do the middle ones? Yes, please. I'll do the last one on this side, and then can you do the middle ones, please? Have I done a good job? Minute. Let's turn the camera around. If they are good. Sparkles verdict. Yeah! <laughs> so now, Matilda, what we must do is put the pan in the oven. Yes, you're going to get your gloves on. <laughs> Although, I would normally use a tea towel for this bit. So, if you just put them on that bottom shelf without spilling the oil. Is the tray hot? No. So, I do need gloves. <laughs> I don't. The bottom one, the very yeah. bottom one. Oh, second, yes. What you're doing is you're heating the oil so the Yorkies rise. <laughs> you think you did a good job? Yeah. Right, so now we're going to have a bash at the batter. And I'm going to try and leave it all up to Tilly. So this is one of these times where you might see sparkles get very stressed very quickly and, and drop the camera. Look. Oh. If she gets it right, which I'm sure she can, then it, <laughs> then uh, maybe it'll all be good. Yeah. So here we go. Yes, yeah, pour the flour in until it's at two hundred. Perfect. So we just give it a little shake so it's nice and flat. Uh, a bit, bit, it's a bit, it's alright, we don't, we're not after perfection here, we're after taste. Right now, 50 eggs. four eggs. In there? Yes, now hang on, what should you do? Before you start cracking eggs, what should you do? Wash my hands? Again? We already did that. Yeah. Um. Promise. So, what I would do is get some kitchen roll and then you fold that in half, lift it up and then you put that under and then you can crack the eggs on the side and then just leave the empties on the top.
Don't fear the egg. Whee. Is that good? Yeah, we need all four. Doing better than I thought. <laughs> Come on, get that egg in. Stop, that'll do. Right now, if you take the thing, the, the jug off the kitchen roll. That on the side and pick up the kitchen roll and get them in the bin. Oh my god! <laughs> Count to ten. One, two, three. Goose Frabe. <laughs> right, now you need to get the whisk, which is here because I washed it earlier. <laughs> now you need to get the tea towel and dry all them bubbles off. Bubbles! <laughs> we don't want soapy orchids. No, we don't. Now, <laughs> you need to whisk the eggs into the flour. Beat them, they call it. Beat them. Just beat it! Beat it! Don't you wanna beat it? Beat it! I'll stop murdering Michael Jackson because I'm not very good. <laughs> so what? You need to do it harder. Just ignore Jack. My Would you like me to do the beating? Yes. <laughs> did I look good though? You're doing better than I do. Well, I'll hold it. Right, tell you what, I will put this down. I'll stop trying to be a YouTube star and I'll make sure the orchids are correct. Here we go. You're getting flour everywhere. Well, that's part of the fun of cooking. I'll tell you what we could do with a little bit of salt. Can you get the salt, please? I'm never entirely sure how much salt to put in these mixtures, so we'll do the sparkles special. And just guess! Sneeze for the camera! <laughs> I don't know if I was going to sneeze or not. This is why on cooking programs they always say, here's one I made earlier. Because this is tedious. Right, I'm going to pause it until the batter's ready. So, we have got our batter ready. Matilda's happy with it. Now it's time for her to get the pan out of the oven. Right, you have to be very careful. So you need to get that pan out of the oven, put it on that. Because remember the oil is now hot. You can do it. Well, there's always a first time. It might as well be on camera. Do you give up? Yeah, I give up. That's probably for the best. So, we've got the pan out. Now comes the fun bit. We need to pour the batter in. Not even a yay. <laughs> batter. And you just basically fill them up. Mm. You want to make sure you've got enough in each one at first, yeah? And then you can always pour extra in afterwards. Yeah. Okay. Don't worry about the oil leaking everywhere. <laughs> we call that the tourist. 
good effort, yeah? Part of the fun of cooking is making a mess. So you can see it's all gone a little bit messy and it was all good until uh, Sparkles got involved. So that one might be my fault. Oh, <laughs> Go tell your mother! I want to tell mummy. Mummy, mummy, mummy. She'll see it on the video anyway. <laughs> Oh, Tilly! <laughs> you, Tilly! You've got butter on your face! <laughs> right, Tilly, now they need to go in the oven. Do you feel confident doing this with a hot pan, or would you like me to do it? I'll take it out, but not put it in. So you'll bring the Yorkies out? Yeah. Okay. Because it's you can see we've cleaned it up a bit. Yes. It's still a bit of a mess. Yeah, but it's out of some metal. <laughs> then we put them in here. And you can see I've got some on the nice kitchen towel. <laughs> and there we go. So now they are in the oven, which was preheated at 210. Oh, we always got time for hugs in this <laughs> house. So what we're going to do now is got to leave them for about 40 minutes. 40? 40! It's 4-0. Yes. And we'll leave them for 40 minutes and then we'll get our Yorkies out. And that's that done. And in the meantime we've got to start on the roast potatoes. And now we're on the video again Wasting time when we need to start cooking roasties Yum yum Mommy will be home from work before long We won't even be close to getting tea ready No No, no, no So now the plan is to do the roasties, yes? Roasties We'll get some nice roasties made and then we'll, uh, once we've got the potatoes cooked we'll get back to you Get them hitched up Yeah Hitch them up for the camera Yeah Come on Pick them up like sparkles. No. Keep my boobies warm. No. Hey ya. Hey ya. I feel like a smirk. Yeah. How are they coming on? They're rising really good. You happy with them? Yeah. Well, how do you know they're not ready yet? I'm happy with them so far. So we're running a bit behind on time here, so what we're going to do is I'm going to peel the potatoes, Tilly is going to cut them and put them in the pan ready. So that's our speed up a bit of time plan. But, uh, sometimes cutting fast is not the safest way to go! Right, so I'm going to peel, she's going to cut. Simple. What I've learned from this potato is that I should have sharpened the knife beforehand. That makes everything so much easier. Right, so I'll show you the first one. So I don't know about that size. So that one, cut it half again, yeah? Okay. Put them in the pan. So you be careful with the knife. Because I've already cut this a lot. Not today. No, not today. Sparkles runs a safe kitchen. Oh, that's a big juicy potato. Look at that. If I pull away, it's the size of my head. If I pull that back, it's not. 
scale. Looks a bit like a bomb. <laughs> Sven is our special boy, but he's not here, aren't you? Sven is upstairs in bed because yes. that's what he does. Yes, you can tell he's my son. Stays up all night and then sleeps all day. The problem is, since I met you and your brother, I have to stay up all day as well as stay up all night. So I'm just permanently tired. Until I'm six feet under, baby, I don't need a bed Gonna live while I'm alive and sleep when I'm dead If by living you mean sitting on my laptop Writing stories and watching wrestling yes. And what better life could there be? I'll say this will be the last potato because there's only four of us mm -hmm. And you know what you and your brother are like for not eating your tea? Yeah. Oh well I had a I had a, a squashy ten hours ago so I'm a bit full. My finger. You're doing well. Have, have we even got you cutting any of these on the camera? Mine. Go on, have, have a bash. Yeah, it cuts like a knife! I have to put Brian Adams in the video now. <laughs> Not wrong with a bit of Brian Adams. You keep doing loads of songs that I don't even know. That's because... Oh my god, I'm old. <laughs> Mind you, Brian Adams was never the coolest. Look into my eyes. You will see that I need to pee. Sven, he always runs away when he starts singing. Sven could come downstairs and run out. <laughs> I think. He's been asleep two floors up. I sing four bars and he runs down two flights of stairs and out the back door. He might be my special boy, but he's bloody rude. I did it. Is that the tat he's done? That'll be enough. Oh my god, the Yorkies are huge! Oh! We need to do a Yorkie check! Mm, the Yorkies are big! Oh, I see his Tilly's reflection. Step back. Why isn't the light working in the oven? Maybe I'll put the torch on. Well, yeah, you can see they're growing. Oh, look at the Yorkie! Yorkie, Yorkie, Yorkie! Still got 20 minutes to go as well. They're coming on nicely. <laughs> <laughs> Felt like Hulk Hogan for a second. <laughs> this isn't working. Tilly wants to show us her wonderful hair, which I believe is a, a triple plait made into a bun. Look at that! What a star! Give us a smile! I can see up your nose! Yeah. Right, missus, it's time to see how these Yorkies have come on. Yeah. You want to get them out of the oven? Yeah. Gloves. Oven gloves. Looking nice. Oh, here we go. Stick them on the chopping board. All right. Oh, that one has a hole inside. Smile. Take <laughs> 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 
So Tilly, are you happy with your roast dinner? Yes. Who made this? Me, I'm you. And are you happy with it? Yes. Look at that. What a lass. Big Yorkie. Oh, that one looks like a tea. It looks like it's the mushroom Yorkie. Yeah, but it also is shaped like a tea. Yes. For Tilly. Yes. Right, go on to the table. Tony gives a big smile.